several different lawsuits have been leveled against bands like Slayer for promoting both violence and death. The January 1st, 2001 issue of the LA Times reported about a case against Slayer for inspiring the sacrificial murder of Alice Pollard. The article declared, they stalked her, they choked her, they stabbed her, and after she was dead, they raped her. It stated that the girl's parents are suing Slayer and its Sony Finance American Recordings label for violating the California Business and Professions Code, accusing them of unlawfully marketing and distributing harmful and obscene products to minors. The article states that three young men belong to the band Hatred and sacrificed a list Pollard to Satan for the band's success. The article stated that one of the young men stated that he and other teens idolized Slayer and had conspired to kill a virgin girl as a sacrifice to Satan, hoping that it would bring fame to their band. The Times went on to report, quote, The boys choked her with a belt and then took turns slashing and stabbing her more than a dozen times with a hunting knife, according to the suit. Sadly, police found Powler's half-naked corpse under a pentagram about a half a mile away from her parents' home. Pollard fell to the ground, praying and calling out for her mother, before the teen stomped her with their feet on the back of her neck. One of the young men admitted that he was embarrassed as to the degree that he allowed music to affect his life. He said, quote, it gets inside your head. It's almost embarrassing that I was so influenced by the music. It started to influence the way I looked at things. Slayer has several songs that glorify things like Satanism, violence, human sacrifice, and necrophilia. Slayer's song, Altar of Sacrifice, is about sacrificing a young virgin to Satan for power. They have other songs like Tormentor, Postmortem, Kill Again, Serenity and Murder, and Necrophiliac. Their song 213 is about necrophilia or having sex with a corpse. It states, quote, Erotic sensations tingle my spine, a dead body lying next to mine, smooth black lips, I start salivating as we kiss, mine forever this sweet death, I cannot forget your soft breasts, panting excitedly with my hands around your neck, how I love, how I love to kill you. Alan Hutkins, the attorney representing the Powlers, declared, quote, the fact is, our society does not allow kids to watch or even get near a snuff film. Still, minors can go out and buy snuff music anytime they want without their parents even knowing. As responsible, loving parents, we have a responsibility to deliver our children from satanically inspired music and encourage them in music that glorifies the Lord Jesus Christ. This is a